Hey there, it's the MMO Examiner Pamcat again with another look at biography appearance options in Guild Wars 2. This time we're looking at the human male appearance options, and just like the female, you'll have a, a, a specific set of options based on your profession. For example, the elementalist has little diff different little sigils or stones floating above their forehead. A warrior has different helmets and things like that. Like I said in the human female video, once you pick one of these appearance biography options in step five, you can actually go back and change its die scheme in step four. So if you picked a shoulder pad or whatever for the guardian and you wanted to tweak the colors on it, you could go back and do that. It's going to default when you first come come through it to a specific one but that may not be the one you want so be sure to go to step five pick the one you want and go back if you can customize it I don't know if for example the engineers goggles are tintable or not but that'll be something I'll look up now since this is still a human all the ranger pets are the same but for char and norn that is going to be different so you'll be want to you'll be definitely want to check that out um, the necro skins were also a little different by the race just a little more detailed. I don't know if that's just still a work in progress. Maybe for the humans, there's, theirs is definitely the simplest. But we'll see. I'm not sure. Like I said, it's a beta, so this is all subject to change anyway. Uh, there's your thief with your miscellaneous headgear. Really no different from the females, just on a man face, which is always great. And I hope you enjoyed it. That's about all we have to look through for the human male. Thanks again.